Hello everyone, today I am going to talk about dry socket. Dry socket is also called alveolar osteitis. It is one of the most painful but easy to treat dental emergencies. It refers to the inflammation of alveolar bone which commonly occurs as a complication of tooth extraction. A dry socket will occur in only 1% to 3% of all tooth extraction. But it is more common in the extraction of mandibular wisdom teeth. In lower impact to wisdom teeth, as many as 25% to 30% of the cases will result in dry socket. After tooth extraction, a blood clot forms on the socket of the extracted teeth mainly to reduce the blood loss due to extraction and also to prevent the alveolar bone from getting exposed to the oral environment. When this blood clot fails to form or is physically lost from the socket, alveolar bone gets exposed to the oral saliva, bacteria and food debris. This results in localized inflammation of alveolar bone leading to a severe throbbing pain that radiates jaws, ears and eyes of the affected side. Clinical symptoms present severe pain onset 2 to 3 days after extraction. Radiation pain radiates to the jaws, ear, eyes and neck of the affected tooth. Intraoral odor, halitosis, bad taste in the mouth, regional limp adenopathy. Signs present empty socket that partially or totally lacks blood clot. Exposed bone, visible and sensitive to touch, inflammation of soft tissue around, food debris trapped in the socket. It is caused due to smoking, traumatic extraction, poor oral hygiene, patient with a history of dry sockets and pre-existing infection. Like pericoronitis, it is treated by cleaning the socket by removing the food debris, use saline irrigation for better cleaning, using medicative dressing, analgesic for pain relief and antibiotic. Dry socket can be prevented by no smoking before and after the tooth extraction, no spitting or vigorous rinsing of the affected site or using straw for drinks for at least 24 hours and maintaining good oral hygiene. Thank you.